This is Tyson with Kicker Technical Support. Today I'm going to show you how to meter out your subwoofers and coax speakers using a simple meter to test whether or not you have a good speaker or a bad speaker. And we'll get started with this Kicker Comp. What we're going to start out with today is a 2010 Comp speaker. This meter is out to be a 4 ohms, 4 ohm sub. Uh, if you ever call in, need help on wiring the speaker, the information we would need would be on the back of this tell right here to tell us that's a 4 ohm speaker to help on wiring and future setup for the install. Basic simple tool to need to meter it out is going to be a digital multimeter to, to test the uh, DC resistance and we'll want to test the back side of the sub. We want to go to the coils on the woofer right here, negative and positive. Take our meter, positive to positive, negative to negative of the meter. I'm going to set the speaker upright on the table. Make sure we have no vibrations. Don't move on the cone. It will change the res resistance value on the meter. What we'll do is we'll take the meter, we'll go to the ohm setting. And right here it is reading anywhere to a 3.8 to a 3.9. The speaker is tested good. If you have any movement on the cone, the resistance value will change. Why we want to have no movement on the cone. Also, if this speaker was damaged or blown, the ohm load value would read really low, around 1.0, maybe lesser. It needs to maintain around 4. And this speaker here is tested out to be good. 